Warning, this game contains flashing lights, loud noises, and jump scares. Hey there, and welcome back to Five Nights at Maggie's 3, where we're gonna be <laughs> starting from the beginning to try and get the true ending. Alright, so I wasn't aware that this was a thing, and frankly, I kind of wish I knew. Maybe I should have watched the video, but it seems like I'm going to have to erase all the data in order to start from scratch, unfortunately. It seems to be the only way that I'm going to get the true ending by actually picking manual. So before that, I'm going to pretty much cover the extras. You won't be seeing that yet, but I'm going to do that before I do all the true ending stuff. So yeah. Alright, so I just finished recording all the extra stuff, but you'll see that later. Very confusing, I know, but we are about to reset it all. That explains it. You have to pick the method of inspection here. Uh, I forgot about that. Mm -hmm. Alright, so now we're going to the official manual. Apparently, official's been crossed out. Ooh, hold on, let's read this. The endoskeleton. Oh, okay, so already we're dealing with a bit more information here. The endoskeleton. The red and blue cables are the most important part of the endoskeleton. That's where the info gets stored in the endo. Find them in the animatronics, cut them, and attach your cables to them. Charge the machine and shock the endoskeleton. The cables will not always be in the same place for all the animatronics. John made sure to not follow a pattern, and creative concepts decided to not change the wiring chest piece and the wires the cables will not always be in the same place interesting wait what oh my lord i don't like this i didn't i wasn't prepared for this all right so hold on it seems like you have to click on oh my god you just have to do that seriously okay so i think now it might be when oh yeah i'd be joking Oh, yeah, be joking. So I'm assuming the reason why the endoskeleton's after us is because we're not meant to be doing this, right? We're kind of like tampering, and the endo is just trying to stop us now. I'm paranoid. I don't like this. I hate this business. I'm trying to decide what's like a safe... Looks like, like, what's safe? How much percent before I check? My eyes. Ooh, okay. Nine... One down. Seven animatronics. Right? Because you have the twins. Maggie. Loaf. 748. What the hell? Hold on. May 9th, 1985. Uh, ooh, okay. We have story, we have lore, we have mini games. Oh my god. Oh! Uh, well, we're not looking too good here. Oh, wait, I'm not controlling anything. Okay. We have what well, looks like blood on our feet. Oh, oh blood everywhere. Okay. The uh, great start. Because I'm I I'm going to have to catch up with the first two games now to see what what's going on, or maybe I can move. No, I'm just breathing. Oh, I can't do this. I have the things, but I need to hide again. Dot, dot, dot. It's not worth it. He's trapped in there. He won't go anywhere. I give up. He's trapped in there. Uh, could this be a reference to the second game? Mm, I get, I'm, not too, I'm not too aware of it, only because, well... I haven't, it's been a while since I played the second game. Considering that, it seems like we have to do a lot more work now compared to before. Can I mute the call still? Yes, I can. But I'm gonna have to sit here the entire time. Alright, and here we have Bob. Uh, I, now I gotta worry about the bloody guy behind me. It's like the manual. Also, yeah, now that we're no longer going the automatic route, um, it seems like no, no more phone calls. So now I have to remove the arms. Okay. Oh, I forgot I could do this.
It's okay. At least I know there's an audio cue now. Good lord. Oh, it gives me a little bit of anxiety, but nothing too crazy. And right now it's not very often, so I mean, I might be able to finish the pig before anything else. Bob. I lied. And we're done. All right. Oh. <sighs> That's one down. Right. I, I, I've miscounted again, right? It's ma It's four on stage, plus the magician, plus the two on the side, right? So that's seven. So we pretty much have to do this process for all of them. But what are exactly are we doing? 1708. So it's 508 p.m. now. March 31st, 1992. Seven years later. Two people inside an office built. Not an office, but like a... Hmm, no, nah, I guess it could be just someone's house. Anyways, I'm gonna go get some coffee. You want some? Yeah, sure. All right, they both went to go get coffee. Hey, do you mind if I read the newspaper? No, go ahead. I never read it. They just leave it in the doorway. The color of the subtitles here is the same as the first guy. So I wonder if this is the same guy that, you know, was like, uh, he's trapped seven years ago. Oh my God, dude, listen to this. The Frankenstein is back. Whoa. After eight years without any trace or appearance, a serial killer known as the Frankenstein has reappeared, taking a new victim, a 16-year-old boy who was reported missing a week ago. Here it says that his body was found in the John McAdams Entertainment Warehouse. That might be... Ooh. Uh, the second game. Second game. Dude, I was sure that John McAdams was the Frankenstein. I can't believe it. I mean, it only made sense. I don't like this. That... that Maybe it was his son, Henry. He is missing, and after all, he really did kill his... Dot, dot, dot. Hey, Steve? Uh-oh. I'm gonna have to ask you to leave. Oh, no. Nah. Is he actually gonna get to leave? Is everything okay, Aaron? Aaron. Wait, this is us! At the... In the fake ending, Aaron Mayer was the one who worked as... Who, oh, whoops. Aaron Mayer's the one who's working the night guard shift. This is us. Oh, yeah, yeah. So he was involved with the place even seven years ago, or like in 85. I mean, assuming that was Mayor in the first minigame. I remembered I needed to finish some work for tomorrow. Oh, okay. You need any help? Nah, don't worry. I'm sorry that I made you come here. No problem, dude. See you at work tomorrow? Yeah, yeah. I'll see you tomorrow. Well, I, uh, uh, he got away. Good. He got, <laughs> Aaron, we didn't do anything, right? Maybe, hmm. Has he had a run in with the Frankenstein? Oh, what if he's the one who didn't? What if he stopped the? What if he? What if the you know person he was trapped back uh, in 1985 was the Frankenstein? Ooh, he didn't stop. Not even in that body. I have to stop him. This is not over. Ah, okay. So I think. Okay, okay. So he's not. Is this not like some bad guy type thing? Okay, I kind of get it now. I kind of get it. Interesting. We'll see how this goes. All right. Well, one thing is for sure. There's no difference in the animatronics behavior. Maggie pretty much moved into the vent like normal. So I'm trying to figure out what exactly are we doing to the animatronics? Like what changes are we having? All right. Now that we're done with night two, we move on to Lolo. Okay. Lolo. His head. Are in... In his head? I don't think that end is supposed to be there. Okay. There we go. Okay. I think I can't do that anymore. It seems like he's starting to get way too he's starting to get way quicker. Is that is that normal? I think that actually might be normal. Okay. And done.
I'm gonna be honest. I don't think I'm gonna be showing the flashing lights because it's just really bright. All right. So last time we were in 1992. Now where are we? Or when are we? I guess. Oh. Huh. Aaron's so. Hmm. 4:13 p.m. Oh, what's the date? 1981, June 2nd. So we're going further back. Maggie's Magical World. So did you have fun? This is us again, Aaron. But assuming the subtitle means the character. But this is also a new character then. Yes, I had so much fun. Okay, let's go. Dad is waiting for us. Ooh, younger sister then. Wait, Henry? Can I ask you something? Wait, no, this is Henry. Wait, what? Wait. So this is Henry. All right, so don't assume that the subtitle color means the same character. Got it. Yes, yeah, Stacy, what's happening? Um, where's my mom? Oh, all the kids in the birthday had moms, but I never had one. Why? Well, um, let's just say she went to heaven after you were born. Oh, also that means our dad is a John McAdams, right? Heaven, like she can fly? Something like that, yes. But why? Well, she got a little bit sick, so she went to heaven to get some help from God. Wow, will she ever come back? Come back? She was always with us. You just don't see her. She is always taking care of us and making sure that we are safe. One day we will see her again, but we have to wait for that. Wow, that's so cool. Okay, now let's... Wait, oh, did she love me? Oh, good lord. Love you more than anything in the world, Stacy. She wouldn't stop holding and kissing you when you were a baby. You were a precious baby girl. Before she went to heaven, she made me and dad promise her that you were always going to get the life and love that you deserve. And that's what we're going every day. And that's what we are doing every day. Wow. Thank you, mom. I'm having so much fun with them. But dad is always working. Maybe he doesn't love me. Oh, good lord. Hey, don't say that. Dad loves you with all his heart. He would do anything for you, no matter what. He's just a little busy right now. But when he's with you, he gives you everything you want, right? Yeah. That's because he loves you. Don't you ever think otherwise. Okay. And does dad love you? Dot, dot, dot. That's not a... That's not a... I wouldn't call that a good response. It's getting late now. We should go inside. Dad's waiting for you. So uh, maybe I'm going to guess he thinks it's complicated or no. Okay. Since he decided to not answer that. My, oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no. I I knew it. I, I I saw the cars. Literally, I was thinking. the first, they, saw, they showed the car passing by the first time. Like, oh, no. I feel like I'm going to see a car, like, swerve into them. But I'm wrong. She, oh, she went into the street. Oh, no. Oh no, I knew it. I knew Stacy was gonna die, but I didn't think it'd be like that. Oh. Alright, well, as if things didn't have to get more depressing, be quiet. We're, 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 we're starting off yet again. I think I realized a quick little trick here to uh, dealing with uh, the twins. And that's literally, you, you activate the vent, you switch off their camera switch immediately, Watch. Oh no. Didn't work. Didn't I was I was thinking too much there. I was thinking too much, but the idea is that you you switch between the cameras really quickly so that it resets you know they leave the camera much quicker. Instead of having to wait for the static. See like that, like that. That's a better way of putting it. All right, night three has been completed. This is going to be my last one for the night, and then we'll pretty much skip over to when I'm a bit more energized in the day. Let's see here. Where is this one now? Uh, somewhere on his head and arms. Oh, well, that's nice. Wait. That's weird. Hold on. Pratt, wait. Not the torso, arms and head. Oh. Ooh, creepy. 
Turn! Oh, yeah, yeah, I swear to God. You're just gonna be a lot more active, huh? This is gonna take a while. I had a feeling you'd be up close this time. I'm not gonna lie, at first I was a lot more anxious about this mini game, but now I'm definitely more calm about it. Anyways, we're pretty much done. Or at least I'd like to say. So shy, aren't you? That's four down, three to go. This is the last one, like I said, for tonight, but let's see. Let's see what's going on in the mini games here. 2.14 a.m. Last time was 1981, June 3rd, the day after. So I already know this one's going to be a very tough one to deal with. Dad, where am I? Oh, no, John's kidnapped his son. Okay. My body hurts. Oh, he did more than kidnap. I know Stacy. Wait, what? Wait, no, wait. Sorry, the dialogue is different. No, no, Stacy. Wait, what? Oh my gosh, she didn't die on impact. Oh, are we in the hospital? I know Stacy. I know. Don't worry. You'll feel better very soon. Dad, I'm scared. I know. Just don't worry. Here, take this. You will get sleepier. You will fall asleep. And you will wake up better than ever. Oh no, wait. No, wait, wait. In a new and improved body. Oh no, why are you putting her in animatronic? Stop it. Nothing will ever hurt you again. Oh no, no, no. Which which one was it? Oh, oh you put her in Maggie, didn't you? Oh, oh. Oh, you put her in Maggie. Yeah, you definitely. Oh no, why am I? <laughs> what did you do? What have you done? Why is there another suit there? Oh no. Oh, John, John, John. All right, so originally I was going to make the true ending its own video, right? Or this would be the entire video, but it ended up being longer than I was expecting. I'm not even halfway through. So I think it's just better to end the video here. I was going to show the extras as well, but that's a bit of an issue because there's actually a spoiler in the extras that I didn't really think about when I was covering it. So we're leaving that for the next video. With all that said, I hope you did enjoy. If you did, leave a like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Let me know you're enjoying the content and want to see more of it. The game is in the description below, as always. With all that said, I'll see you in another video. Take care.